Hello and welcome everybody. Thank you all for, for being here. Uh, it's, it seems like yesterday that I was just here, back in September. So it's nice to be back with a friend of mine, Micah Wright, fabulous clarinetist. Um, so the first piece that you just heard was Leonard Bernstein's Clarinet Sonata. And it's uh, one of his first published pieces written back in 1941. So it's very, very interesting. And um, as you heard, the first movement sort of has these remnants of Hindemith Right, uh, but uh, as we hear in the second movement, there's elements of West Side Story and that dance-like element too. So it's a very exciting piece, both for pianists and uh, clarinetists. So yeah, would you like to say something about the? Sure. Yeah. So um, Jason and I have been playing a few concerts together uh, recently, and both of these clarinet and piano pieces have been on our programs. Um, the Bernstein Sonata is a staple. Every clarinet player learns that, uh, usually in undergrad or somewhere early on. Uh, the piano part's pretty difficult for that, I would say. But um, the cookbook, uh, not a staple. It's a piece Jason introduced to me, actually. A really cool piece uh, by Kenji Bunch, a composer based in Washington State. Um, I will say this is a harder clarinet part, so... Um, it's almost like string writing for me, so I've had to kind of expand myself a little bit to, to try and get through it, but a uh, great piece nonetheless. Yeah, just to piggyback on that, Kenji Bunch is actually a violist, so there's a lot of, like Micah said, there's a lot of string elements in this piece that are probably not clarinetistic. But a fun fact, uh, when, in our first, one of our first rehearsals with this piece, when he, was re we, he and I were reading through it, he was like, huh, this could be, good on a clarinet for some of it, and he actually took the time to transcribe some of it mm -hmm. uh, for a clarinet, because apparently it would be easier to, to read and play. So um, That's why I have yeah. two. <laughs> there, there you go. <laughs> this is a really cool piece. It's a piece I, I played on a student's jury for their end of semester jury, and I was like, this is a great piece. It's a, it's a war horse of a piece, especially for the, for the clarinetist. But it's cool because it goes through all these really interesting styles, right? You'll hear elements of, uh, it's a lot of jazz actually, a lot of jazz writing. Um, there's like some Spanish influence towards the end and some, a few surprises in there. And uh, there's even elements of kind of rock and roll sort of, right? Or totally. something yeah. like that, yeah. yeah. The whole thing feels like a jazz solo for him. <laughs> But it's a really cool piece, and I hope you enjoy this. This is The Cookbook by Kenji Bunch.
Thank you. 
Thank you so much. One of the other styles I totally forgot to mention was like the klezmer style, you know, that Jewish uh, influence as well, Middle Eastern influence in, in what Micah was playing. So really great piece. I know there's a workout. <laughs> so now we're going to switch things up a little bit. And uh, Micah is actually a very talented pianist as well, which is, which is amazing. Amazing clarinetist, amazing pianist. And uh, we're going to play a really familiar tune, a really great arrangement of uh, the Maple Leaf Rag. Want to say anything else? Or... Uh -oh. I'm just glad I don't have to, to make any more sounds with my lungs, so that'll be nice. Ha, ha, ha. 